Now, I've definitely been through these ruins before. So I'm not really sure what to expect other than possibly empty ruins. Look, a cave. Keshit wonders what's inside. Bandits, undead, monsters. Oh my. We are, we're going to be very, very careful. I don't think I've ever been here with the Ditaku though. I think I came here with Michelle Lioness, yes, in the early days. Before I took her back home and, well. This one has a bad feeling. Weapons at the ready. Yeah, good plan, mate. Good plan. He's become a little more talkative and useful lately as well. I think he's jealous of the horse, you know. Pretty sure that's what it is. Okay, Draugr Deathlord. So we got Draugr. What was the other thing you thought might be down here? Ancient Nord Sword of Ice. It's not very not exactly brilliant. How are these not seeing me with this much ambient light? Is have I got? No. No, you don't. You don't. You, you don't have uh, night vision on. Okay, so we've got Draugr. This one wanders to himself sometimes. Where will he store it then? Where will he be when age a consumes him? Tunnel off him? this way. Hmm. Only time will tell. Curiosity and a. Ooh, hello. What was in here originally? I can't remember. There was there was something a bit odd. Hello? Oh. Well, if you want it that way. Unfortunate, but yeah. I wanted to talk. Apparently she didn't. Ah, journal. Part one. Have I read these? Arundel's journal, day one. Seems the cretins of Dawnstar is not quite as foolish as I had surmised. They found my experimentations, and needless to say, they were not pleased with what they saw. No matter. My work can only flourish without the distractions of living amongst the unenlightened. I have found a cave off on the north coast of Skyrim that will be more than sufficient for my continued studies. The ruins of Ingvald should hold the materials I need to learn more about the reanimating and enslaving the dead. On a personal note, I will miss the young maidens of Dawnstar. Such beauty was intoxication. I often found my thoughts wandering around them, imagining secret encounters between myself and one or two of the local girls. Okay, total and utter lech. On top of which, I'm almost positive I've been here before. And the girls are ghosts of... Oh, the ghosts are ghosts of girls. God, that's a mouthful. That he kind of kidnapped and brought here and then killed them, reanimated them, and yeah, I don't want to think about what else he did. Suffice it to say, if we find him, I'm not going to be thinking long and hard about what to do. No, I'm not. What was that? I don't want to hurt you, but... Sorry. Really, really sorry. I am. Um, I'm so sorry about doing that. And a Draugr as well. No diary in here, is there? Snow bear armor. No. It's kind of cool looking, but nah. Nah, I don't want it. 
leaves straight ahead. What I don't really remember is everything being like this. Be at peace. Okay, we are looking for... That screams hidden door to me. Yes, it does. Yeah, these are empty because we've been here and done this before. I'm sure of it. Where the passage is off, I, sh I should probably check every passage off to the sides. Yes, I should. Oh, hi. I almost didn't see you, but then I did. Oh, I need to charge my uh, my bow. Yes, I do. How's my sword doing? Yeah, charge that too while I'm here. Oh, I don't have any more left. I did drop a stack of them off, though, to be fair. Guess we're going down. I, I can't want to... Is there anything on the other... Okay. There looks like some kind of way up there. Okay. You wait there, Ditaku. I just want to see what's up here. Oh, hello. Nice. Yeah, not so nice. That seemed like a lot of effort for very little. Yes, it did. Oh, there's these urns, though. Best not knock me off, dude. Oh, well done. It's weird seeing Draugr in a place like this, though. Did a good job there, mate. Nice one. It could easily have knocked me off that very narrow perch I was on. This one yes, he could. Sometimes. Where will he I wish, end? though. Where will he be when age consumes him? Tataki was a better hmm. shot. Only time will tell. Okay, let's continue on a little more slowly and hopefully we shan't cause problems. Journal, part two. Day eight. I have established a temporary workstation in the cold caves and have found multiple burial chambers within the snow and ice. While in the first chamber, I exhumed a few test subjects, all female, I was stunned to find my mind wandering again to the women of Dawnstar as I examined my find. At first, I was slightly disturbed by my thoughts, but later found myself reevaluating. He really is like a necro perv. Day 9. The first trials went splendidly. Each subject was reanimated in a state of total complacency, bending to my every task and whim. I have ordered a few of my new servants to guard the island, while the rest act as my personal entourage, standing by me at all times, standing watch over me while I sleep. You know what's coming, don't you? you? You just kind of know what's coming. Here's a sick m mother father. I'm guessing the drag of. Okay, I think she knows I'm here. Whoa! Okay, direct hit. 
least I've changed. Where's what the hell? Where's my sword? Okay. That's why I don't like using the sword all the time. I probably just set off about a thousand traps. Oh, I was still sneaking. Well done, me. We really knocked me flying with that. Bouncing around. I usually kind of dodge it, or it doesn't have quite such a big effect. God, another desk. More notes. Day 21. There's a bit of a gap here. There's a bit of a gap. An intriguing development. Tonight my guards have brought me a trespasser they found near the cave. At first I was understandably upset. Not only was I disturbed during one of my few moments alone with my favourite servant, but I recognised this trespasser as a milkmaid from Dawnstar. She remembered me as well and made bold claims that I had been lurking near her at all hours. What lies? True, I had taken notice of her on occasion, but she was nowhere near the most noticeable of maidens in town. Her continued accusations, coupled with my fear of more uninvited guests, led me to conclude that she could never return to Dawnstar. My servants were quick to carry out my sentencing. Her body is here next to me, as I write this. Funny, her eyes are still full of life. Perhaps I will try a new experiment tonight using fresher materials. Oh, God, ow, ow, I can't even make that vowel sound. What is it the, the, like American women do? Ow, I, I don't, I can't do it. I'm just sounding bad trying, aren't I? Ingvild Throne Room. <clears throat> Mind your step. I will. Okay. This is all very familiar. I'm just wondering if Legacy of the Dragonborn resets a bunch of places you've already Kajit been. has a bad feeling about this. Watch yourself. I will. Do I attack? Is she just going to be another one of his victims? And looking at this, we're not coming back up this ramp easily. Let's sneak behind her just to see who she is. She could be one of a recent ghost that kind of has their memory. What was that? He, however, <laughs> definitely isn't. She's just a ghost, okay. You're the sick bugger, aren't you? Well, take it. Necromancer gear, yeah, exactly. Good call, mate. Sneaking around them, definitely the way to go. Read reality and other falsehoods. I think I've read it, but okay. And apparently I need to find other diaries. Empty urns. Ooh. Take it. You can always sell the potions. You don't get a lot for them, but... They kind of seem okay. Okay, I've got a door behind the throne, and then another door down here. Or another cave this way. And it told me to find all the journal entries. This one I wonders to himself sometimes. Where will his story end? Where will he be when age consumes him? Hmm. Only time will tell. Following me round like an idiot. Because if you haven't buggered off yet, you never will. Okay. Oh god, not what I wanted to do. I'll just leave you be there. Breton. Oh, lockpick is no good to you now. 
shopkeeper's clothes. This is his little... I hate to use the word, but harem, isn't it? And a way out. Okay, let's go back up to that room. I remember this, but I don't think I've gotten all... Well, anything, really. We got some of his diaries. I don't think we got all of them. That just sort of came up incidentally. made it quick and you're already dead anyway okay we have grand stuff of charming and a big chest Gold necklace, leather boots of resist shocking yeah did he not have another diary somewhere Not unusual gem inkwell I don't think I got them all. I haven't found the coin yet. Aha! Uh -huh. Look! <laughs> we found the coin. So was... He didn't have anything else on him, did he? Oh, I'm trying to get him so I can see what he looked like. <laughs> no, he's determined to remain face down. Okay. So return basically is the options I've got it wasn't really a return from here I don't think I found all his diaries unless that was all of them and to be honest with you I'm pretty sure Mind your step. come on Ditarchy get out of the way I'm fairly sure I've read them all before I'm not sure where this leads though I mean yes there was a spiral staircase but where did that come out? I should go back to Dawnstar and tell them that, you know, they're missing people. You know, somebody's daughter, somebody's sister, somebody's wife even. Somebody's mother is lying dead in here. Some icky burger has been necromancing them and doing God knows what else. Chess. There we go. Hmm. Leave the robes. Useless to someone like me, I think. Let me guess. It's the secret door I spotted on the way in. Yes, it is. Right, I need to take these back. Didn't miss anything. No, that's the way we kind of went exploring, isn't it? Right. So, I think that's it. There probably are other diaries in here. Honestly, don't really want to be reading them. No, I don't. Okay. Now we could get back up, but hey. I think we dealt with him very humanely. I didn't even want to ask him what the hell he thought he was doing. Seems pretty clear to me. Oh god. It's the middle of the night and we've got a snowstorm. Surprisingly light for the middle of the night, but hey. Now, I don't have to go all the way back to Dawnstar to get the horse. I can summon the horse to me. However... Get 
I'm kind of thinking. Don't summon him here. This does not look like a very good place to bring a horse. No, it doesn't. Number one, you're on an island. And weather is pretty bad. So from here... It's like getting across to the mainland isn't so bad. Probably go over this small island and then find our way to a road and then ride back. Yeah, sounds pretty good. Can I get out? Okay, don't get stuck under ice. Oh, God. That's never good. No, it isn't. Okay, am I on mainland proper? No, I'm not. Okay. Okay, that's a lot of fire going on over here. What the hell happened here, dragon? That's a little weird. Is it not? Okay, road. A road from here would be pretty much dead ahead up here. Actually, do you know what? I think... I think um, yeah. Where, where was it that or was it an item? It's like a shout, isn't it? Ah ha ha! And I has a horse. Yes, I does. I just doesn't have a horse menu or a horse for my companion. She's, you know kind of off-putting. Let's try and get past these without dying. Just run the Taku. You can outrun them. Yes, you can. Find that road. Okay, I think I've found the road. Keep going. I mean, it ain't much of a road, but it certainly looks like a road. Okay, well, we'll follow it in. Inland a little bit. Refuge. That rings a bell, actually. Stay with the road while you're on a horse. Don't get it killed. Oh. This road apparently ends here. So, back downhill then. Oh, God. I wish horses could turn a little better than they do. Yeah, see, I told you could outrun them, Ditaku. Have faith. I think this is the road I want. Riding at night doesn't seem nearly as bad as walking at night. Is this going to be more bloody bandits this way? Port Dunster. Do I want to go? No, I want to actually... Find a way across, don't I? Sorry, Dutaku, I'm messing you around there. Yeah, this is the thing, you see. I'm I'm so used to getting across Skyrim going a bit, you know, over hills and mountains instead of taking the, you know, the actual roads that taking the actual roads gets me lost. Like I needed any help with that. Night, 
fool. You can't stop us. Of course I can. I can get near enough to hit you. I'm not trying to hit that. I'm trying to not kill the horse. Okay. Am I looting them now? Okay. Got a red guard. Okay, red guard. Dear vampire boots. No. Looted vampire. Fledgling, 11 o'clock. Titaku. No, I don't. <sighs> Talk to you later. <laughs> Forgot he was there. Um, the Ice Wolf. Looted Vampire Fledgling, 11 o'clock. Nothing good. Right. Note to self. Fighting on horseback is a little bit not your thing yet. So I'm charging in willy-nilly. Although I think Dawnbreaker, definitely the right choice. For vampires. It's a little dark. At least I can see the road. Death really? To the oh. Hi there. No. No. Yes. No. Dawnbreaker. No. Not good. For vampires. Assassin's Writ. Okay. Let me guess. Who sent this one? I thought I killed off the leader. By order of the Patrician of Movarth's lair, you are to hunt down and slay the Dawnguard agent Kevan. He is believed to be extremely dangerous, even for one of your formidable skill. Strike quickly, sister, then make your escape. Didn't quite work out like that, did it? No, it didn't. Where's the horse? Yeah, I thought would be better. Um, let's ride. Yes, indeed. And I need to try and figure out a way of getting a horse for Tataku as well. Yes, I do. You'd think the ghostly daylight coming from Dawn Breaker would clue them in to uh, don't bother, you'll just die. Does that actually apply to the undead though? You'll become really un... well, you become dead again. Who leaves logs across roads, really? Am I going the right way? Kind of, I need the... There we go, Dragon Bridge. Yes, indeed. Yes, it... You've reached your horse's training goal. Awesome. So has he now got more stamina? Well, not much more, anyway. Ah, there we go. Solitude! Uh, where to leave the horse? I think... I think I'll leave him at the stables. That would make sense, wouldn't it? There you go. Let's have a look at his training thing. You should rest and meditate on what you learned. Um, did you do endurances thing, isn't it? Okay. It's actually really quite romantic in the great city of solitude at this time of night, which is pretty early in the morning, as a matter of fact. Yes, it is. I do like the torchlight as well. It's 
rather fetching. Now, I should be able to take horse call, favourite horse call, and then I've got it there, I'm like, yes, I don't want to use it right now, but, seriously, has nobody, nobody's cleared up the, well, I suppose they've got most of the dragon off the road, but they've dumped it in somebody's sort of, well, I don't suppose it is a garden, but, yeah. Yes, I know I could just use my night vision to talk to. It's probably best if all of Solitude don't know I have night vision. Now, we want to get back with our small find and hand it in, I think. Hail, Samana. Conjure me up a warm bed, would you? Conjure you up a bash on the head with this torch. I think it's this dark because it's kind of been raining. I've got a little work if you're interested, traveller. Who is that? Go fiddling with any locks around here. We're going to have a real problem. Yeah. If you're heading to the Blue Palace, you might want to rethink that outfit. Sure, I'll take your advice. Um, right, now, the museum... It is. The sun's about to rise. The museum may well be closed. If it is, well, we could get a couple of hours at the house. See, I've got a house here now. It's rather nice. Yes, it is. Let me guess. Someone stole your sweet roll. Who's he talking to? Is he just gone a bit bonk bonkers, that guy? We'll try the museum first. That would make the most sense, I think. Well, it's not locked. But uh, what's his name? Are you Aaron? May oh, well, no, he is in fact awake. I found the artifact you wanted. Oh, good! You are turning out to be quite the sound investment, I must say. Good job. There are, of course, more to find, like this one. I've gotten word that a small shipment of Akaviri relics was being transported across Skyrim to Markarth. But the caravan was attacked by Forsworn. Yeah, they tend to do that. Among the items in the shipment were a number of Akaviri jade carvings. If you could search the area around Markarth, perhaps you may come across some of them. Okay. Locate a jade statue. Well, that's interesting. What time are we now? Well, it's almost... I think technically it is dawn, isn't it? Yes, indeed. Okay, well, in which case, let's pop back to the house, have a little breakfast. Where is this thing? An interesting... Grey... A, a jade statue. Kill the leader. We could do that on the way. I can't remember who gave me that. But yes, we could do that N route, and then it's not very far to here. Locate a jade statue. You've got a bit of work to do around this area. It's going to involve killing quite a few. Oh, 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 I've just remembered. I have a book to deliver. Do you think these guys are open? Apparently, they, I like solitude. Everybody seems to get up early here. We like that. Well, if we can find the person we're looking for, they're probably in bed. Someone's not in bed there. Or there. Is that them? Oh, this is what. Yes, he's up, he's reading, he's busy. Welcome. Ah, you've returned. How goes the task I gave you? Uh, well, we found the book, but. There's an awful lot of crossing out been done. I have to admit, I didn't think it would actually be there. Now, let's take a look at this. Oh, 
Oh no, this won't do at all. Yeah. The copy is incomplete. It's aged to the point that parts are unreadable. And the parts that are readable, well, bardic verse has come a long way since ancient times. Come a long way, or which bit are you talking about? It means I can't read it to the court. Without the verse, I won't be able to convince Elisif of the importance of the burning of King Olaf Festival. Oh. If she isn't convinced of the festival's importance, then she won't reverse her decision to stop the effigy burning. It means that the burning of King Olaf, which the Bard's College has held for time immemorial, won't be happening. Um, can we make any of it up? Make it up? That doesn't seem appropriate. Yeah, Bard, that's what you do. I can copy his style based on what you brought me, but I have no idea what happened in between these verses. Yeah, I mean, look. Singing songs, acting, it, it, it's all, you know, playing make-believe, isn't it? How hard could it be? Come on, we, we can do this. We can do oh, this. Oh, Olaf, our subjugator, He's the one-eyed one betrayer, death-dealing be? demon Where and dragon-killing king, your legend is mm. lies, lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex Hakan for the ages. King Olaf was Olaf One-Eye? He famously captured the dragon Numenex and took him to Dragon's Reach. What did we say really happened? Uh... Right, if you're gonna go... If you're gonna go with it, you should go big. I find that highly unlikely. But the court will love it. I'm writing it in. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Okay. Olaf grabbed Next. power by promise and threat. From fall grief to winter hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong, Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant, inspired, and wicked. Strange. According to history, Solitude attacked Winterhold, but this seemed to be saying Olaf reacted. What do we say happened? Uh... Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, Olaf sacked it in dragon form. Oh, that is exciting! I'm sure the court and the Yara will love it. I'm yeah, right I mean, now. come on. Is that all of it? It has a few final lines, but that's all we needed to add. I need to head to court immediately and present this. You should come. Oh, um, well, I'm not reading it out. Understand? Oh, thank you. I've been working on an original piece. I hope it can stand up to the classics. Who? What? I'll be the judge of that. Now back to your practice. <clears throat> Sound really carries in here, doesn't it? Is that by design, I wonder? I've got to go to the palace. Okay, what time is it now? Eh. Well, it's like we skipped breakfast again. Said I should go to the palace. Has he gone straight there? My god, he can move. I'll give him that. It's a beautiful morning as well. It really is. I'm just going to read this out in front of everybody. He's not going to involve me too much, is he? I'm not really one for uh, that sort of thing. No, we're not. Is he here? It's not even here. <coughs> I thought he'd come straight here. Where's he gone? Dear, oh dear. Is he going there later, or...? Well, according to this, he is here. Oh, dear me. Yes, hello. Yes, I know I just left. Oh, I'm here. I do hope the court likes the verse. I think we've done an excellent job of recreating it. Yeah, if you're gonna lie, lie big. I think my voice is ready. 
I hope we've done this well. Listen, mate, it, they'll love it. They, they really will. They will absolutely love it. Okay. Watch him perform. We will. Walking, running, walking, walking, running. Okay. Oh, are we waiting for the y'all? Hello, y'all. And I want to ask her about being a thane as well. Ah, Viarmo. I assume you are here to petition for the reinstatement of the burning of King Olaf festival. I am, y'all. I wish to present King Olaf's verse from the Poetic Edda, recovered this very day from the Bard's tomb. You mentioned something that would convince us the festival should take place, but I didn't expect King Olaf's lost verse. Please proceed. O oh, Olaf, our subjugator, the one-eyed betrayer, death-dealing demon and dragon-killing king, your legend is lies, lurid, and false. Your cunning capture of Numenex, a con for the ages. No shouting match between dragon and man, and no fire or fury did this battle entail. Olaf was Numenex in human form. On moonless nights, he would spread wings and sail. Olaf grabbed power by promise and threat. From fall grief to winter hold, they fell to their knees. But solitude stood strong, Skyrim's truest protectors. Olaf's vengeance was instant, inspired, and wicked. Because solitude would not soon bend knee, Olaf would hurt them while his status accrued. He sacked Winterhold in dragon form, and bent their minds to blame Solitude. So ends the story of Olaf the Liar, a thief and a scoundrel. We of Solitude commit to the fire. In Solitude, bards train for their service. They also gather each year and burn a king who deserves it. You have proven your point, Viarmo. The festival is truly a celebration of solitude and a condemnation of false kings. I thank you, and the college thanks you, Jarl. Furthermore, I believe that such a fine poem deserves some payment of patronage. The college will be very generously rewarded. Oh, thank you yet again. I will make sure our applicant, who was instrumental in recovering the poem, will be well rewarded. Make sure that he is. The Imperials Unbelievable! Business business You've done us a great Skyrim. service here. Yeah, I knew you could sell it. I know it's a... You enough. So, you're making me a bard. Have you heard me try to sing? Would someone give that man a bar of soap or introduce him to the concept of soap? Soon. This is an unfortunate these things must be done properly. You will be inducted as part of the festival itself. I need you to go speak to Yorn. He was preparing the effigy of King Olaf. Tell him to finish the preparations. The festival is back on! Okay then. All questions to the steward. Folk fire the entire fight its own war with its own funds and without hijacking our Hi, and soldiers. It's a fine day with you around. Have I? No, I've Be done everything there. You're not that naive. So I don't know if I am Thane or not, but soon. we bought the house, we did her a favour, and we have property. So I think I am the Thane by right, no am I not? With any locks around here. We're going to have a real problem. I am not a thief. It was one library book and it never left the bloody library. Dear me. Right, I've got to tell some guy here that it's all back on. Who are me? See how is that him? Okay, that is a weird thing to have in the middle of a courtyard. Is it for horses to drink out of or something? Okay. 
Okay, I need to speak to somebody in here who lives in the floor, apparently. No, I guess that means they're downstairs. Right, where... Ah, there you go, there you go. You there. Yawn. Ah, the bard to be. Did Viarmo send you? Yes, the festival is back on. I'll tell everyone we're ready. But we'll start the festival at dusk. Come talk to me after dark. We'll get the festival started when you do. Okay. Right, well, we've got a bit of work to do in between, don't we? Understand? At this point, I hardly see how your advice would improve it. It's flawless. I'll be the judge. Where the hell are those people? Are they? This one wanders to himself sometimes. Where will his story end? Are they arguing up here Where and the sound is carrying consumes? down? Hmm. Only time will Oh, end. I see. Okay. They've got like a bit of a church up there. But I don't think it's actually a church. They've got another one on this side. The Baldelier's fake book. Do you know what? I thought that said Facebook. Which would be really weird. Right, we have a mission to complete. Or a quest. And it looks like if I can get it to stay there. Locate a jade statue. It seems like that is one of the last things he's going to ask me to do. And I'm assuming once we do that, we'll be able to sort of... Hey, want to play tag? No. Uh, we'll be able to walk around the... museum, I guess. Because it's all blocked off. I, I, I kind of wanted to have a little look around in there. A cave? Curious indeed. We've been in there and cleared it out. We're not going there. No, we're not. We are headed up here into the mountains. Okay. Oh god. I haven't got the shield, have I? Wait there. Why does it Oh this is so annoying. Who are you guys? You are some old friends. Alright guys. Marcus. You've been a good friend to me. That means something. Alright then. Okay, Farkas. Well, I didn't need my uh, weapon drawn for there, no. This one Okay, well we're fairly close. A bear. We don't need to kill a. What am I saying? We're, we're near Farkas. Of course, we're killing a bear. 